the office tour, Nerdy Banana HQ, Birmingham. Welcome. Come on in. Greeted by Alex and Tanner. Looking for sorted celebrities. So here you have it, the office, uh, Nerdy, Banana, Nerdy Banana HQ UK. Uh, over here, as you can see, it's pretty busy. Given we got just three days left till uh, the last post goes, so the guys here are flipping snugsies, ready to be stuffed and sewn over here by Alex and Yasmin. Pile is slowly piling up. This is going up and down all day, every day from about six till three in the morning. I think the last person is at the moment, uh, Laura, who's been sewing away, which has been a big help. We've got the Eat good, feel good. That's our motto in the kitchen. The sewing bunch. Come in and say hello to them. How, how, how many snooks do you reckon we've sewn this year? Of course, at least 60,000. Oh, yeah. There you go, 80,000 snooks have been sewn in this very room. Which is not great from the last room. We've actually got a room now. They used to be out there in the. Not in the freezing cold, because it's not cold. It wasn't freezing cold. You can't say that. Okay, it was. <laughs> they've got a nice warm room now. Motivational quotes to get to the day. So thanks to Toy Story and Buzz Lightyear. To Infinity and Theon. Yeah, this is where all the sewing's done. This is where the underwear, the snugsies, the dog toys, the knickers, pants, the thongs, dog clothing. What else have we got? The hot water bottles, the fleeces. This is where it all happens. Shown up by these lovely people. Lovely people. <laughs> Insert lovely people. <laughs> a week out from a week out from Christmas, the last post. Things are running smoothly. We had a problem with one of the sock printers yesterday. Um, getting someone into service that. But things are running pretty smoothly at the moment. A few late nights. It is. 2 a.m. job here, 8 a.m. wake up. Mm. But we go again every day. 4,000, uh, 4,000, 5,000 snugsies to get out the door. As you can see by the piles over there, there's quite a lot to ship. But all in all, I think we're in a good place. We're in a better place than we were last year. This is the meeting room, ran by Amy at the moment. We always Amazon all this. <laughs> but as you'll see, lovely shed. Type of office with actually no, currently no window or door. The door's always open, James. Remember that. Um, yeah, this is where we'll have, not weekly, weekly, monthly meetings in there. If people aren't stuffing, it's just too loud. We do have glass to be put in, but it's not going to happen yet. We need to do that tonight. Along with the door. <laughs> After we shipped all the Amazon blanket. Uh, so this area here, this is where we do all our work with any fabrics. Everything's printed, it works its way through the roller presses that then go into the uh, sewing team at the back. We've got stuffers. I say stuffers, it's like the bare stuffing uh, is done at the very back. We've got two or three of those. Here we are, James, Super Socks, London, Oxford Street. As you can see, um, here for Christmas time. We're 15 days away from Christmas, we're starting to get busier and busier. Um, so come down and see us if you're in London. And in, in this room here, this is where we do all our customer service. There's Lottie smiling away at the back. She's loving the YouTube videos at the moment. <laughs> Oh, there's Max. <laughs> He's not in Selfridges to that. So yeah, in here we do all the customer service. Uh, our designers and creative are also in there. So we've got Lottie and Millie at the back. Tickets and emails coming in. We're probably dealing with around 300, 400 emails today at the moment. So they're keeping all the customers happy on social, on Zendesk. And then, what else have we got in there? Luke, Emily, Sophie at the back. We'll go into Selfridges. Yeah, those are YouTube guys. This is where it's happening. Again, a lovely, warm, cosy room. Keep everyone happy. We haven't done any major decorations this year. So. Tree, Whose idea was that? I see it's a good idea. Charge of Christmas decorations. <laughs> Best ever too. So, as you can see, we've got Selfridges bags uh, just here. Uh, come back from Selfridges, unfortunately. You'll also see 
the Birmingham unit right here. Um, 16th of December now. Obviously only launched in store. Um, when did we launch? The 24th of November. So uh, probably been in there two and a half, three weeks. But unfortunately had to withdraw due to staffing issues and low footfall in store. Um, heard one of the guys say that footfall in store, in store and the ball ring was down 35%, which is obviously pretty shocking. I thought it was better with all the kind of um, online orders that are coming through at the moment that all the attention is on that. Uh, myself and Charlie um, made the decision to come out of Birmingham. We're actually about to come out of Trafford tonight as well. Uh, similar issues there as well. A um, few people have uh, caught COVID. Uh, a couple of staff members have, have taken the early holiday um, and jetted off uh, before um, it seems like lockdown uh, is about to is about to, to commence again in the new year, new year. So obviously that was supposed to be in a week's a week's time withdrawal. Um, London's going really well at the moment though. Um, just sorting some more stock out there. Um, we're actually doing kind of 2019 figures there, which is great. Um, given all the kind of um, problems and everything we're having at the moment. Uh, Dublin also going really well, but uh, having some problems with deliveries. FedEx haven't delivered a parcel that we needed for socks. So we had to get Luke, one of the managers out there to fly out here on Tuesday. Went off with two suitcases back home. Um, so yeah, there's there's lots of challenges, but uh, it's all it's all fun and games. So, so this is the cut off here, the all fabric, snug tea, this end of the warehouse. As you can see here, Sock area. That's why this man here, Chief Nerdy Banamina. Chief Sock Nerdy Banamina. Uh, yes, he's rather banging out of socks, these two presses. So we can get around 2,000 pairs a day out on these. Constantly working. Ollie's one of the sock, fastest sock printers in the world right now. Doing this thing. Definitely. Three days to go. Three days to go, four days, three, four days to go. Four days to go, so yeah. Dolly's here till 4 a.m. tonight. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, nice try. <laughs> so, yeah, we've got the socks here over this side, back to where it all began. Oh, on the way. It's my bed. This is where I've been sleeping the last, uh, well, since the beginning of November, really. So, it's nice and comfy in there. In the pillows. This is the Dumble Togs area. So, this is where it all started. This is what I started probably 10 years ago now. 10, 11 years ago now. It's where the socks came from. Doing some everyone uploading customer photos on underwear and socks, uh, which started the Super Socks Madness, really. Uh, we've got embroidery. This is where we basically put all our standard and our t-shirt printing. So we put your logos on shirts or photos, text, all your kind of basic custom merch. Here he is, James. What are we cooking up, Matt? Right, as you can see, there's lots of orders that are coming through at the moment. Um, Very popular. So, just trying to organise all of the print files for those to come out. Yeah, super busy. And it's only Friday, so Saturday is going to be even busier. And they'll have the Christmas tunes on, everyone will be wanting to spend some dollar, which will be great. It's been busy, um, it's been Christmassy. Christmassy. Great. The camera's in front. <laughs> We're cooking. It's Christmas. Um, just had a problem with one of the printers, so orders are backed up a little bit, as you can see. Um, busy in store today. Two weekends to go until Christmas. We've got loads of orders. The socks are really popular. Um, I think as soon as one person starts on the screen, it's like a flash mob. Everyone comes in. Go crazy for socks. Yeah. I usually sleep here one night, at least one night a year, so at some point next week. It has to be done. Tradition. Every, every year it's gone from being about three or four nights, then the following year was a bit less, a bit less, and then last year was one night, so maybe this year I don't need to stay overnight, but we'll see. Do it from Sammy's. Beautifully and very clean, tidy stock area. Managed by the main man, Adam. Down here, we've got all the wrapping paper, we've got portraits. And Jordan is pointing over here. There he is. Hey. <laughs> Talking about how busy London was on the weekend. Yeah, when went to Selfridges. Um, this, our stand was, was rammed. They rammed, yeah. Yeah, I, I wanted to go on the machine, and I said to my missus, I said, hey, 
you know, <laughs> I work here, let's, 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 let's use the machine, get some new socks. And waiting in the queue, waiting in the queue, and then it just got to a point where a bit uncomfortable here. There's like, you know, people, there was no space to walk in socks. Yeah, yeah. I thought, alright, I'm going off. <laughs> that's, that's mad. Yeah, that's mad. There you go. Even our own employees can't get to the super soft stands because it's so busy. So it's kind of the things you so want to hear, really. <laughs> yeah. Air freshens over here. Managed to run by Sarah Pernell. Yeah. 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 Talking, we do a lot of talking over here. Uh, we do a lot of talking. A lot yeah. of talking, a lot of gossip goes on down here. <laughs> also, Lottie, she wasn't, she, she's supposed to be in there, but she likes to be down here. We have a chat every now and then. Just check up with the girl. <laughs> she's a low down, what went down. Is that right? That's very accurate, yeah. <laughs> what went down. We've got the creative team on dispatch today. Pack the orders. Well done. A bit of a change of scenery for these guys. Okay. Spent most of the day at the computers designing and drawing away. So yeah. today they finally said, Charlie, what we want to do today, we want to pack some orders. Exactly. We'll come down to help out. Get the 5,000 orders that have to be packed by Thursday out the door. So, and this is the big pile. The big pile of orders, beautifully stored, ready for dispatch. Slowly getting taller and taller above Olive. It's just kind of <laughs> claps on shore at some point. Yeah, the guys in the dispatch are literally busy getting all the orders out the door, really. So we've got about five packing stations, all of which have been busy from sort of 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. every night. <laughs> all being drowned by the radio right now. And Adam with his fork, fork truck. I don't want to fork <laughs> As it stands at the moment, his, uh, his request has been denied. <laughs> have you enjoyed it so far? Do you like socks? I love socks. What's the general Max. consensus? I love socks. Ever, ever so much fun, isn't it? What's yeah. it like having Max as a boss? Max is quite a good boss. Yeah, I'll give it to him. Put them in the microscope now. Abby, yeah. any words from you? Abby, has been. Max is the best boss. <laughs> <laughs> What's the plan for next year, Charlie? For the next install? year? Oh, what are the plans for next year? Any spoilers? I think we're going to definitely do something with Dogsy next year. Possibly something with the portraits and prints and canvases in the homeware section, hopefully. Uh, who knows? We might bring Snugsy to install. That'd be pretty cool. You can't make them install because it's too, too difficult. And then possibly something in America, the big United States, whether it's Comic Con, whether it's a big store, Bloomingdale's be on the list. Who knows? Two. Into my domain. To James's domain, this is where we flip. Flip and get a little selfie from James. <laughs> Got the nerdy behind Jim. Got a few pull ups up here. It's been a busy day. Wonderful Jim. <laughs> <laughs> not, quite as good, not quite as good as Jim Sharks, Jim, but it's a, uh, it's a gym. And then here is the. Photo studio, which has become a bit of a snugsy storage area. Needs a tidy in the new year. Yeah, yeah it definitely needs a tidy in the new year. Little revamp. Then you've got the full warehouse, as can be seen from up here. This is where I, this is where I stand when they make out when they're not printing too quick. What's that here and say, print faster, print faster. I drop a few little motivational quotes, as you can see on the walls. The, the vision would be is that you'd come to the stand and you could look at a screen, the socks would be on your feet on the screen. So yeah, VR. something very different, something very different, Where's something digital. Really? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, VR, yeah. something quite digital. You're very Instagrammable for all the Instagrammers, but uh, yeah, yeah, something, something a bit more of a kind of experience and visually a lot better than we've done. We just, you know, the screens are very appealing and kind of bring people towards the stand but actually something moving with socks. Who knows? I can't reveal too much. But yeah, this is us, Nerdy Banana HQ. Well, Nerdy Banana UK HQ. Hopefully, soon to have an American HQ. What can we expect from the LA office? Will it be uh, completely different or That's much a very good question. That's a very good question. We'll have a few American flags, I'm sure. Just being American myself, you have to, you have, to have a few American flags if you've got an American office. 
I think every Christmas after Christmas, we look at things operationally and we think actually how can we do things a lot better, uh, which really every Christmas we see new things that we can, we, we can do a lot better. So I think January, February time is definitely a time where we look at everything and we go, actually we need, to, we need to improve X, Y and Z so that we can fulfill more orders, we can get things out quicker. Um, we're actually be looking in the new year to offer next day delivery on most of our items, which is really unheard of and, very, and it's also very difficult to do that and also scale at the same time because when the volume volume comes in actually trying to get it made and out the door that same day is very difficult but we're going to try it uh, with the power of automation i think we will we'll will try our best because that's where we need to be we need to be open seven days a week now because people who order on a saturday or sunday they want it on a monday so yeah we'll we will we'll be a seven day operation On the vlog? Oh, yeah, you are. Here we go. <laughs> James, special appearance. Here we go. A few words, James. Where are we today? We've got super socks here. We're at super socks. Uh, obviously, we get some new socks from um, for Christmas. There we uh, go. What do you think of Max and Charlie on the vlog? Max natural in front of the camera. Uh, I think he should vlog every day. <laughs> we get a daily thing. I'd watch them all.